What's up, people? Real quick, I just got to get something off my chest, man, because it has been bothering me lately because I'm just sick of seeing people in this hooping community or whatever you want to call it. And even just not even people in the hooping community, but just people at random gyms, old heads, people our age, people that always claim that, oh, they were so good back then. And like, oh, yeah, a couple years ago, I was doing this and I was doing that. I was crossing here, snatching there, pulling here, laying there. Like, you wasn't doing that, bro. And, and it... You don't have no footage. You ain't got nobody backing you up for real. Niggas just be talking. Just be, just be, ah, like, why are we, how are we supposed to take your word for that, bro? When were you good? They be talking about, oh, I'm about to get back right. I'm about to bring out the old me and this and that. The old you was trash. What do you mean? That nigga was boo-boo. He was a bum. What do you mean? I'm about to, I'm about to bring out prime me again. Nobody was worried about prime you what are you as somebody who was actually pretty solid and did drop off because they started doing other things i don't know it just gets on my nerves because now when i say oh i'm about to get back right it makes it sound corny just because there's so many other people who have said that but they were never actually good so i have old footage that i can show y'all of me and my best friend trey who was way better than i ever was um in high school he was giving the number four team in the nation, 25, pulling from the volleyball line. That man was nice. And he's another person who stopped taking basketball seriously and kind of fell off as well. So I want to show y'all how we were moving back in 2017. That was, I want to say 2016 was his prime year. 2017 was my prime year. He's a year older than me. He was in the class of 2016. I was in the class of 2017. So instead of telling y'all, oh yeah, we used to do this. We used to do that. I'm going to just show y'all. I just want y'all to pay attention to how like I'm dribbling because the narrative about me, people see me play on House's channel and they say, oh, you can't dribble, you can't dribble, this and that, which is true. Right now, I cannot dribble. But before, I was never no Kyrie Irving or no shit like that. I'm not going to say that. But I definitely had a solid handle to where I can get to my spots and I can make great moves. And I drove a lot more back then, too. I settle for jump shots a lot more now because my bag just isn't like that anymore. But with minimal drills and just staying consistently in the gym, all that's going to come back. So I'm not even really worried about it. But yeah, just pay attention to detail. Just see how much I'm driving. See how I'm dribbling. See how Trey's moving too because that man is nice. Y'all going to see some current day stuff of him as well um, playing on my channel. But yeah, I'm not going to keep talking. I'll save that for the end of the video. Y'all enjoy the 1v1 footage. See y'all in a bit. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. What the fuck I say? He can't fucking guard me, man. I get the drift from my wall. 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 A bad bitch. We just go. Oh, we gonna take his ass to the right. Cause he, 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 he can't, he can't guard the, 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 he can't guard the songs. He can't guard this. So. Yo, chill, chill out, coach. Come on, I just, we just gonna, we just gonna take him to the right and, and sauce his ass. Ain't well.
<laughs> yeah, yeah. Why the kick and do I sip it? Take it in your blood. What the fuck is up? You bought a cut. Fuck it in that blood. Going up against Anderson. Axel's way. All just because I ripped my pants.
Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> That's not his game. That's not his game, yo. Did I blow the lead? Yeah, I blew it. Oops. But uh, besides me blowing that lead, I hope y'all just got to really see how I was in my bag. Like there was moves like the quick tweens to the basket, double crosses to. The, it's just I had all that, bro. And like I said before, I was never no Kyrie Irving, but you can see how my handle was solid. Yeah, I lost the ball a few times, but. Who, that I mean that happens it's basketball as far as me just making good moves and driving to the basket and creating shots and this and that I just feel like it looked really solid back then so I don't know I just I really wanted y'all to see that footage so that y'all could see what I mean when I say oh 2017 me prime me because there's a lot of people out here they be talking about oh they was so nice and stuff a few years ago whatever the case is but they ain't got no footage they ain't got nobody vouching for them they just talking but with me I figured I could show y'all better than I could tell y'all this whole YouTube thing like yeah it's cool that, you know, I record my stuff now, but, like, this is the most organic thing I've ever done because I've always been recording what I do. Like, I just think it's really dope to be able to film things and look back on it later. So when I started my YouTube, it was like, I might as well. I'm always recording stuff anyway. But uh, my IQ is better now, but as far as just skill-wise and this and that, there's definitely been a drop-off since then. So I want to, you know, get to the point where I'm back comfortable again. But it doesn't necessarily have to be at that level of hooping it that makes sense but yeah man i hope y'all enjoyed that 1v1 footage i ain't gonna talk your heads off too much i hope y'all have a great rest of the day and um i'm not sure if i'm uploading this today or tomorrow but uh yeah y'all see it when y'all see it y'all already know what i'm trying to do i'm trying to do what i don't even know why i wrote the window down that was i've never done okay yeah i don't know why i wrote the window down it's felt like the right thing to do in my head for the outro i don't i don't know what i was getting at but anyways i'll catch y'all in the next video trying to do right catch y'all in the next you already said that, bro. I'm out of here. Peace. <laughs> I take my shot and get groovy. When I walk in that bitch, it's a movie. Uh, she on my head, she groovy. I can't fuck with that bitch because I'm true. I can't. I stayed in myself.